Uh, it's all the big famous old handicaps now. It's the Northumberland Plate, the Pitman's Derby. It's two miles not to one ten. Uh, it's only all weather these days, which I can't have a fun of. Modern Bell, Craig Beckwith at the top. Devilish Gelding, Darren Thompson. Stupid Cupid, Craig Beckwith. Lady Macbeth, Leon Van Rensburg. October Tiger and Zephonic Bell for Graham Clutterbuck. Clip Bales for Satyam, Sandra Sager and William Wordsworth for Paul Rhodes. And Satyam's got another one in there, deep backward square as well. So the field all installed and ready to go. And away they go. And Devilish Gelding was quickly out, but now October Tiger looks like he's going to take it up. Derek Clutterbuck, Graham Clutterbuck likes these long distance races. Deep backward square for Satyam has got to the lead there and has Norman a Satyam front runner than Grey, who's gone on, leading by two or three lengths to William Wordsworth, who's now second. October Tiger is third. Lady Macbeth is in fourth. So we've got all sorts here, haven't we? Lady Macbeth and William Wordsworth. And then we've got some clip bales and a devilish gelding as well. But there you go. It's deep backward square in the lead then. Oh, silly mid off. It's oh, William Wordsworth in second. Then October Tiger is third. Lady Macbeth is next. Then clip bales and modern bell. Zephonic bell is after that. So we've got bells all over the place as well. Stupid Cupid is after that one. And devilish gelding is just the back marker. So the leader is taking them along on a good clip. And he's a good five or six lengths clear. Of William Wordsworth in second and October Tiger third. Lady Macbeth is in fourth. Then comes Modern Bell and Clip Bales. And then Zephonic Bell. Stupid Cupid is after that one. And Devilish Gilding is the back marker. That's the Satyam front runner continuing the lead then. Deep backward square. One of his cricketing reference horses. William Wordsworth is in second. October Tiger's third. Then Lady Macbeth. Clipped Bales is next. And then Modern Bell and Zephonic Bell. And then Stupid Cupid and Devilish Gilding bringing up the rear. Deep Backward Square then takes them into the final mile with a lead of two to three lengths to October Tiger in second. William Wordsworth on the inside is third and then Lady Macbeth is fourth. Modern Bell is getting considerably closer around the outside. Clip Bell is just being pulled off the fence to make sure it doesn't get boxed in. Zephonic Bell just squeezed for room a little bit there. And then Stupid Cupid and Devilish Gelding at the back are both going to try and get splits up the inside rail, I think. But it's Big Backward Square who continues to lead. But only by two lengths now. It's October Tiger in second. William Woods with his third. Modern Bell is in fourth. Then Clip Bales, Lady Macbeth just dropping back a little bit. Zephonic Bell coming around the outside. Devilish Gelding and Stupid Cupid have both got work to do at this point. And it's deep backward square then who starts the long sweeping turn into the home straight. Lead still by two to October Tiger in second. William Wordsworth. Now Modern Bell starts to really get going on the outside. Lady Macbeth's got a second wind as well. Clip Bales is trying to get going, but suddenly deep backward square is being pressed by Modern Bell. Modern Bell coming through the challenge for the lead then with two and a half furlongs to go. Back in third is still October Tiger. Lady Macbeth is next. Stupid Cupid is also running on his well for Greg Beckwith. He's got a big hand in this race and it's Modern Modern Bell who takes the lead. Modern Bell takes it up then as Deep Backward Square starts to go more backwards than square. And it's Modern Bell in front and they come down towards the final furlong. Modern Bell's in the lead but Stable Companion Stupid Cupid is swooping on the outside between the two of them. Lady Macbeth, October Tiger. Here comes Clip Bales on the inside as well. It's Stupid Cupid and Clip Bales on the outside. is Zephonic Bell but it's going to be Clip Bales who's going to get up to take it. Clip Bales wins his Zephonic Bell in second. Stupid Cupid, William Wordsworth. And all the way back to Devilish Gill. So, Satyam's deep backward square led all the way, but Clip Bales got the dream run through on the inside, and was that all part of a plan? As Clip Bales takes the Northumberland plate for Satyam, Sandra Sager, and Zephonic Bell for Graham Clitterbuck was second, Stupid Cupid for Craig Beckwith was third, William Wordsworth for Paul Rhodes was fourth, and deep backward square for Satyam again, hung on for fifth.